Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to add shaders to your CurseForge mod packs. So for example, you have a mod pack, so you want to go ahead and choose a mod pack to which you want to go ahead and add a shader. Uh, and after that, you also want to go ahead and install Optifine. So you want to go to uh, official Optifine website and download your Optifine. But before that, you want to go ahead, press on your mod pack and you want to see which version the mod pack is. So as you can see, it's 1.12.2. So this is the version of Optifine you want to go ahead and download. So you want to press preview versions, show all, and you want to find that version which your mod pack is. So it is this one uh, for me. Just let me check one more time. Yes. So we want to go ahead and download it. Yes, download. Now for this, you also need complementary some shaders, basically. So what you want to do is go ahead and select the game version which you need. So uh, this one, depending on your mod pack, and just download the shaders you like. So for example, I just downloaded this, these ones. Now I have them here on my desktop. What you need to do now, you can do this by pressing on this button here and pressing open folder. From here, you want to open up mods folder and drag Optifine right there. Once Optifine is here, you want to go back to your mod pack and you want to find a shader packs folder. If you don't find it, then just create it and then drag that zip file sh uh, shader pack, basically, which you have downloaded, add it there. And uh, now all you need to do is press play. Now, if something is not working, I also suggest you to have Oculus shaders. So it's instead of iOS, and it really works good with Forge Mod Loader. Now, once you are here, you want to sign in, of course. Now, after you launch the game, you will you will need to go ahead and press Escape and press on Options. After you will press on Options, you want to press on Video Settings. And after that, you want to press on shaders. Now on shaders, you will see your installed shaders. You want to go ahead and press on it, choose it. Uh, it will take a little bit of time to load up, but that's pretty much it how it works. So if this video was helpful, guys, make sure to subscribe to this channel and I will see you next time. Bye.